Hey honey, I'm doing something fun tonight. I'm using our secret cake pan, which is two of these scallop size pans. All right, how fun, yes. baby. I'm gonna make a tie-dye cake, baby. Yeah. And I dug out what I thought was the closest yeah. to tie-dye. Got a lot <laughs> of to colors do a there. theme party, baby. Yeah. And uh, it comes with two inserts. We're gonna use this one today. So this is gonna be after we bake the cake, we're gonna have these nice little holes. Yeah. And we're gonna fill it with some nice treats that I'll show you in a minute, honey. Nice. And then it also comes with the middle one if you want to have like a secret center instead sure. of something in every little slice sure. You can do the center and we've actually used both at once before where we had the secret center And then on the top we turned it upside down and then put fresh strawberries yep. in the top so Multiple ways you can use these pans. So I've already uh, Fixed up one here and I'm really y'all simple Regular cake mix, just a box of cake mix, yep. divided it somewhat into thirds, just kind of eyeballed it, just mm -hmm. followed the normal directions. And then Sugar and I had a little fun mixing colors. So this yep. is something fun you can do with the kids too, because we took our uh, blue and our red, honey, and we yeah, made, we made purple, purple for yep. my dear friend Georgie. Yep. She loves her purple. Rest in peace, my best friend. I love you and miss you. I love you too, Miss Georgie. Um, I used my measure all, which I love because it has the measurements going up and down. So you can put your dry ingredients on one side. You can use your liquid, which I've measured my water and my oil in. So did that. All right. So here we go. So for number two, I'm going to get this going again. And I'm just using my, this is the large size of the scoop. And again, I turned this upside down so we're gonna have an empty spot in nice. there when we're done gonna have those little secret cavities that's right and you just kind of you know and this is not a science to it yeah. <laughs> kind of just get in there probably got some purple yep actually i think i'm gonna start moving some of these out so i can get up in there better yep all right and again you you kind of make your color and your pattern we decided to do three colors I mean if you wanted to do more you certainly could do more trying to use up most of this batter because we want it to end up being a normal size cake honey yep all right and then we do some blue I kind of made mine more of a tealish blue yeah you know I'm all about teal blue yep. you're my mermaid <laughs> all right Make sure we get that covered good. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's see if maybe I got a little more of this I can get out. Yeah, probably a little bit more. A little bit more red. more red, just to, even though it kind of mixes in anyway before it's over with. But go ahead and just make sure we cover that good. Yep, use it all up. And then we're going to use our cake tester. We're actually going to use the other end here. Okay, the releaser part. And we're gently, and we're not going to over mix it here, y'all. Just a little bit. Yeah, just gonna mix the colors up a little just bit. Just a little bit. Just Get that tie-dye tie effect. Yeah, so that every piece has a little bit of a, each color in it. Yeah. Okay, I think that's good. Yep, that's you good. said you don't wanna go too crazy yeah, with it. Yeah, they said not to go crazy with it, yeah. I don't wanna go too crazy with it. Nice. There we go, that's a nice one. All right, so now we're just gonna go in the oven as normal, and then we'll come back. Now, honey, over here, we're gonna have a little project which you'll probably enjoy. While that's in the oven, I got out my prep bowls, my one cup. We're going to do a little um, project here. Yeah. And we're going to separate the M&Ms out by color. Nice. A and you got your peanut butter ones, and I got my regular ones. So we'll do a couple slices with peanut butter in it and some regular. All right, we're going in the oven. Okay, baby, here we go. All right, so we let this cool a little bit. Now, this is the one that had the little jimmy jiggy jiggy do yeah <laughs> and first of all you gotta love how our, our non-stick our pans are yeah you know i can't never say enough about that and then you literally just pop this little thing out mm -hmm. try to do it a little bit careful there we go and see how Look you have that. your little holes you know that blue really turned out tealish well you know i love yeah. teal and yeah. then over here i did my little project nice separated those out and literally, I'm just going to use store-bought icing, and I'm going to actually use the spreader. Yep. So that I'll, you know, ice in the other parts. We'll put the goodies in the middle, baby. Yep. Now, I could use my cake decorator and be a little fancier, but honestly, it's football night around here, honey. That's right. <laughs> I need to hurry up and try a piece of cake in. we, we, we got to cheer for our team. we got to go cheer. So I'm not going to do all that. I'm just going to do it old school, nothing too fancy. This is just for us when I have a company. Yep. All right. So I'm going to get that going and we'll come back because I don't want to 
take up too much time. All right, honey, having fun putting our little colors in. And like I said, I didn't do anything fancy with the piping of the icing. I'm going to make it a mess. <laughs> I love it. Okay. Love me some M&M's. Let's do, these are your peanut butter ones here. Oh, yeah. You know how you love peanut butter. But, y'all, this would be great for, say, Easter. Yeah. Putting um, jelly beans in there. Yeah. Um, you could put Skittles. Because when we were at the supermarket, we were trying to decide what to put in there. But I don't like Skittles. Um, Skittles. Um, don't they have some little we're, sour we're candies? About, we're talking about doing colors? like we're talking about doing like candy corn. You know, now for the fall. That's true. Yeah, you could do like different Halloween candy. You could do a Halloween cake. You could put the little eyeball candies in there. You could do the, um, you know, like the little bats and the little black kitty. We saw a black cat. Yeah, we were looking at decorations, Halloween yeah. decorations. Yeah, we saw a lot, a lot of Halloween decorations. You, you, you could put that stuff in there. Where they cut into the cake and they get they, they got a bunch of eyeballs. <laughs> you know, that'll be cool. All right, I just have this on our Lazy Susan to kind of help spin it around. And again, I'm sorry, this is not going to be anything beautiful tonight, honey. But <laughs> hey, we're, we're, we're no professional baker. I got to get to the to the game. Yeah. Team is playing. I got to go, baby. I love you, but I got to go. Let's go. All right. So I'm just going to finish that up a little bit. Oops. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We had a wreck. You're good. <laughs> All right. Hey, this is a test kitchen. Exactly. All right. So I'm going to cut you a piece real quick, honey. All right. And actually, you know, if we wanted to kind of give people a heads up of what we have in there, mm -hmm. we could throw some M&Ms on the top. Yeah. I hate sprinkles, but we had yeah, some yeah, sprinkles. We're not, we're not so, fans of sprinkles. You know, I know. We could, you know, we do something like that. But, you know, of course, put a lot on there. Yeah. Um, if you want to give them, like I said, if you want to give them a heads up, mm -hmm. maybe what's in there or don't. Don't put anything in yep. there. And then they have no clue what's in the mm -hmm. um surprise inside yep so i'll decorate it a little bit for you honey all right we'll put some more on there later go ahead and cut you a piece just so they can kind of get the effect i got the slicer there for you we'll come back and make it prettier whoa yeah oh Look at that. There you go. Did you get your got your candies in there somewhere? Look at that. That's pretty. All right. And the candy should be hiding in there somewhere. Oh yeah, there they are. <laughs> there they go. Now they're coming out. There we go, baby. All right, give us a quick taste. And then I'll I'll make her a little prettier before we take a picture of the final cake. I'll put some more. M&M's on the top. Mm. I hear the crunch over there. I love it. So it's good mm -hmm. and, and it's fun. And it would just be, you know, again, something for the kids, fun birthday cake, anytime. Delicious. All right, everybody. Thank you. Thank you.